CAA is encouraging motorists, commuters, cyclists, and pedestrians to nominate the worst roads as it kicks off its annual campaign. For the past two decades, CAA has put roadways across the province under the microscope and calling on municipalities and the provincial government to make improvements to congestion, signage, potholes, and other road safety concerns. We're so proud to be celebrating 21 years of this advocacy campaign. And thanks to the voices of tens of thousands of Ontarians, the annual CA Worst Roads campaign gets results and has been able to influence change. The CA Worst Roads campaign is open to all road users across the province to nominate for the roads they believe are in urgent need of repair. Every year, these votes have helped inform various levels of government with an important perspective on what roadways need improvement and that are important to Ontarians, and where that infrastructure priority funding and investment should be made. This campaign is designed to have your say and vent your frustration about anything to do with road infrastructure. Damage caused by potholes can be costly and an unexpected out-of-pocket expense. With the rising cost of living, CA believes in the investment in roads and supporting infrastructure is more important than ever before. Inflation has made consumers more mindful of their purchases and expenses, and many are opting to hold on to their cars longer versus buying new. A poorly maintained road can cause damage to a vehicle creating an unexpected expense for a motorist. And our research has shown that 42% of our respondents had experienced vehicle damage because of poor roads. Once the list is revealed, CAA talks with local governments about the concerns that they have compiled. And we talk about the priority areas uh, that we want them to, that appeared on the list. We talk to them about their planning and how that goes and what, what their needs are. And often what we hear from municipal leaders is a desire for more dedicated funding from senior levels of government. And in the past, the province and the federal government have both made commitments. They're usually short-term grants uh, you know, with conditions. And so we're always calling on the senior levels of government to make sure that uh, not only they invest in new infrastructure, Last year, York Road in Guelph topped the list for CAA's worst roads in Western Ontario region. Bad roads do cause safety concerns. We're very, you know, when you start to hear about people are rerouting, so first of all, they're taking maybe routes that aren't familiar to them or navigating on roadways that weren't designed for high volume traffic. Um, but also when you've got 62% of people who are swerving, you know, swerving on a road where there's nobody on may not be so so dangerous but listen it's very rare especially in the GTHA that you know swerving you've got cyclists you've got parked cars you've got other cars it's not what we expect when we drive is that all of a sudden you're going to see st sudden swerving and so this does cause a safety concern people do feel that poor ro roads impact their safety you can vote for CAA's worst roads until April 19th Visit caaworstroads.com.